Hey everybody, it's me, Sissy. Today I'm back with a little tiny Dollar Tree haul. Trying to keep my promise to myself and not spend money that I don't need to. Don't buy things that I don't need to to clutter up my craft room and my house. So, But I saw some things and I just had to have them. So of course I had to get them at Dollar Tree. So let's get right to it. Let me get in. Drink a coffee. It's very cold and rainy today. So coffee will warm me up. But we're going to start with this um, Pure Vent two disposable face masks. These are kid size and um, I, I think they'll fit me but I bought them because they had a cute design and the adult ones didn't have a cute design. Not that it matters but I'm just going to try it and see because some of the face masks that I that I get are really big and they I don't feel like they fit me. Yeah, see that'll fit me. So if you have a a smaller head or a small face um, these will work for you so I picked those up and in the craft department I picked up this cute little wooden sign we're gonna make a little something to go on that I'm not quite sure yet but it was cute um, one of my Dollar Trees that I've been going to has really they have redone their craft section and it is so nice um, I was really surprised because it's not one of the better Dollar Trees, so, but it's got a really good craft section now, so I was happy about it. Um, I picked up the cute little Easter sign with the truck. I'm going to make an Easter wreath for Christmas. I got, um, uh, uh, what is it called? <laughs> Pro Bow, Bow Maker, and I have an idea for a wreath that's got some flowers in it. it's going to have this sign but it's mainly going to be this huge gorgeous bow so hopefully I'll get that made and, and y'all can see that if no unforeseeable things happen so <clears throat> then I saw these cute little mason jar lids and these are a built-in flower frog this is great for fresh flowers you screw this on your jar, mason jar this fits a standard mason jar I think I have to check and see or maybe it, no, maybe it only fits a smaller jar, but I'll have to check and see which jar it fits. But then you cut your flower stems and you put one in each hole and it holds all your flowers exactly right. So that is really great. I love that. So I bought that for myself and I got my sister to buy one too. Then I found the cute little llama, no drama llama little bag. I'm going to use that in my purse to keep my receipts and things in. And I have been loving these hydrolonic acid bubble face mask. Um, it just feels so good on your face. You can feel the little bubbles tingling. So this is my um, Sunday treat. I take a nice long uh, bubble bath with a, a mask on my face and my hair. And I have someone for your hands. And I just take a little me time and try to get back in the groove of things. Um, then I picked up these really pretty Spring Fling 16 napkins. Um, the shape, maybe I'm going to use these when I set my table for Easter. Um, maybe do a little tablescape. I thought these would be cute, so I picked those up. And my Dollar Tree was out of bags, and I didn't bring my bags. I forgot to bring my bags. Um, so they were putting them in trash bags. I felt so sorry for the, the manager. He was telling me he was having a hard time. He had three people quit. He couldn't get anybody to apply. He was short of people, and then he ran out of bags, so he was having a bad day. But um, I packed all my stuff. I bought a little basket and packed it up. Um, I almost went and bought another bag, but I don't need another bag. I have so many of them, but I love bags. I picked up, usually I don't buy food items because there's not a lot of low-carb options options in Dollar Tree, but I picked up these Hunt's 100% Natural Fire Roasted Diced Tomatoes, and it has six carbohydrates a serving minus two fiber, so that's four carbs a serving, which is a half a cup, so um, I thought this would be good if I made a little skillet pizza to put this on it. Um, I love tomatoes. I, that's one thing about low carb, I, I'm kind of sad about is that tomatoes have so many carbs in them because they're so sweet but okay and then I picked up the um, decor six piece the little carrots I thought I would do like a little Easter tree with these carrots and with the um, decor 
Easter decor, the foam eggs. Um, I thought that would be real cute, so I picked those up. And um, I had the little white branches like I used in my decor for Valentine's Day, but I thought I would add this multicolored um, branches. These are really cute. I can use these on into the spring, too. So those are really cute. I picked those up. It's called Glitter Branches. Um, and they, they have four different colors, so I picked up one in each color. And I saw... And this is all, I mean, it's all jumbled around. I never do my stuff in order. Um, let me tell you what we did when we went to Dollar Tree. Usually we go in, we start on the first aisle, we work our way through. <laughs> well, we went this time, and um, my sister and I, we, I don't know, we we're all ladies. So first thing we get there, we're like, we have to go to the bathroom. So <laughs> we ran to the bathroom, and it's on the, like, the end of night, the last aisle that we would normally go through. So we went through it backwards, and I just felt lost the whole time we were in there. I couldn't figure out where I was, but, you know, it was sometimes different switching it up. So, maybe we looked at stuff differently than when we go through the other way. So, but anyway, I had never seen this in there before. It's the Fabuloso Antibacterial Multipurpose Cleaner. It smells really good, so I picked that up. And then, this is my find. I thought these were so cute. These um, are just like the gnomes that I found for Christmas. As the big tall bunnies. Aren't these too cute? So normally I don't decorate too much for Easter, but I couldn't pass these up for a dollar. So I got these two cute bunnies. I'm gonna make one a boy and one a girl and put them on a little display. So those were so adorable. Um, if you see something in Dollar Tree, when you see it, you need to buy it because when you go back, there won't be any more. Because I went back to Dollar Tree, my Dollar Tree didn't have any more of these. So and then to change up my table setting, I have the red and white plates, which are my everyday plates. But um, I bought these um, from the like wedding section, the uh, white plates with the silver border. I'm going to use these for Easter because I didn't think the red ones kind of went with Easter. So I bought these to go on my table setting for, for Easter. And then I'm kind of redoing. My sister has a kitchen island that she's going to give me. And I'm going to actually take this counter out. My kitchen is really, really tiny. And you can see my stove is right here. This is so tight right here that I can barely get the oven door open. If I, like when I do the turkey for Thanksgiving, I can't even get over there to get the turkey out. It's really, really hard. So she has an island that has wheels on the bottom. So I'm going to take this out and put it in so that I can roll it out the way when I need to get to the oven. So I'm really looking forward to that and maybe I'll show you a DIY because I'm gonna change it. It's butcher block, I'm gonna paint it white, kind of make it match. I got ideas for so much stuff, y'all. I hope that I get, get to feeling better. And now that I'm sick, I'm not sick, y'all. I just been feeling bad, you know, for all the stuff that's happened and and then my little doggy. And, but um, anyway, <clears throat> Um, I got this um, vinyl top liner. I want to line the inside of my cabinets. I redid my pantry. Maybe I'll show that to you how I um, reorganized it all. And I got containers and everything. Like everybody's been doing on YouTube and their pantry with the containers and the labels and all their stuff. So I kind of wanted to do mine too. So anyway, <laughs> I'm going to do the shelves with this liner. This is great liner. And um, they had one that had red on it, but they only had one roll, so I just picked up the one that was white and gray, kind of marble looking. And I got four rolls of it. And then I picked up this cute Cupid's Corner bucket, and I did go buy some candy for my people at work, so I thought for Valentine's Day. I was going to bake cookies, but I'm still kind of scared about home-baked goods with germs and everything, so I thought I'd put the pre-wrapped candy in here, and then they could pick. And my last thing and my best find, it just kind of touched my heart, was the little um, Valentine's Day scarf with all the puppies on it and a sloth. So, but I just, and a kitty. So I just thought that was adorable. So I picked that up. But anyway, y'all, that's my Dollar Tree haul. Um, for me, this is a small haul. But it, it, I mean, it seems like a more stuff than it really is. But anyway, y'all have a great day. And bear with me. I'm going to get back to my old self and get in the groove. Um, 2021 will be a better year. I'm praying that it will be. But y'all have a great day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.